Hi everyone, I am Priya and I am from India and I'm doing PhD here in Taiwan. And you have no idea how many times the Taiwanese Indian noodles have saved my life. This video was brought to you by My Room Abroad. We not only help foreigners find apartments, but also Taiwanese who are looking for foreign roommates or short-term rentals. A year back, I got accepted in Taiwan International Graduate Program in one of the best institutes in Taiwan, that is Academia Seneca, and my parents didn't even know where Taiwan was. But after what happened, they know. Lab hours are hectic here, and I don't really get to eat on time. Usually when I came out late, I didn't know where to eat. But one night, this Taiwanese guy gave me this Taiwan instant noodles, and it completely changed my life. Life changed. Instant noodles is not really a popular thing in India. It's not something which you think about when you're starving. But this, this is something about which I think even during my experiments. And it even has real chicken. What a treat. Mm. Oh, I can feel my mom's presence. Woo! I've been in the lab for a year and whichever time of the day I try the instant noodles and how many different flavors I have tried, I can truly say Taiwan is the kingdom of instant noodles. As a budgetary PhD student, Instant noodles are my best friend in Taiwan. After coming to Taiwan, I have been asked several times, how safe is it for women to travel in India alone? According to the perspective of a single female researcher like me, I would like to say that it's not really safe. There have been instances where my friends have been groped in the subway and it's not really uncommon. There were several times that I had to leave my experiments unfinished or halfway and I had to head back home because the safety was a really important concern for me. I've been here for almost a year and safety is the last thing in my mind. I can hang out late, I can work late and I feel really, really safe here. Thank you for keeping it safe.